Hey there, everyone. This is your host, Scotty Oka, and welcome back to Tales of Arise on the PlayStation 5. I'm still in town. I went to the inn just so that way I could get some rest, get some food in me, because, oh my god, uh, yeah, I had nothing. So, <clears throat> right now, we are getting ready to head out into the world. Oh, this is what the town looks like in the sun and not in knife, which I was totally accustomed to at this point. Okay, so for those who, uh, excuse me, uh, may have missed it or may not remember. So in the last episode, we found out the truth about Alfin, the fact that he is like a 300 year old man who had not a romantic relationship, but some sort of relationship, you know, at least a friendship with, uh, an ancestor of Shion, which is why he's like, ah, do I know you? And she's like, no, I don't know you. And he's like, are you sure we had never met? And she's like, yeah, I'm positive we never met. So uh, I'm wondering if maybe because it's possible that her ancestor did survive that, if like whatever happened, the catastrophic event that uh, uh, Alfin had created, essentially genocided most of Lenegas. Uh, I'm wondering if, like, if she was affected in some way, and that, in turn, like, down the line, just, quote-unquote, cursed the entire lineage because of that reason. I, I don't know. I'm, I'm pulling at strings here, especially since, you know... Shion cannot be touched, so if she cannot be touched, how the hell did everyone else get in her lineage become touched? So, you know, yeah. Um, lots of questions, all that fun jazz. Uh, oh, and I do have to say, unlike Tales of the Abyss, which Luke is like, I didn't do it, I was tricked, OMG! Uh, Alfin, uh, yeah, no, when he found out what he did, it's like, oh man, Alfin, I am so sorry, I know you didn't mean to do this. You don't even know what you did. Holy crap. I I I like Tales of the Abyss up until that point. It's like, wow, that could just kind of ruined it. Just like uh uh well, I was gonna say I, 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 I was gonna say unlike uh oh crap, uh we got some skits. Unlike Tales of Desteria, which everyone for some reason doesn't like, and I'm like, I like that one. It makes me sad that we didn't have, uh, what's her name for like 90% of the game, but hey, I liked her a lot otherwise, and I wish she was like a permanent member. Hiking through the jungle! It feels like I'm melting. Calaglia was pretty hot, but at least the air there was dry. Out here it feels like I'm trying to walk through thick soup. I can hardly breathe, it's so stuffy. And don't get me started on the insects. You hanging in there, Hoodle? <laughs> it's brutal, all right. I can feel my energy being drained away just by walking. All this vegetation makes it hard to keep an eye out. Keep your wits about you, everyone. And watch you don't keel over while you're at it. What's needed at times like these is a relaxing hot spring. That would soon help us adjust. And where do you expect us to find one of those? What about you, Alfin? All that gear, and you hardly seem to be breaking a sweat. Yeah, I guess when you've lived a life devoid of pain for as long as I have, even feeling hot and bothered could be a welcome change. Well, lucky you, I guess. Just don't expect us to carry you when you pass out. Aw, oh, man, here I was hoping to be carried like a princess. Uh, oh, okay, there's Zoogles. I didn't even see them right there. Ow. Stupid Zoogle for me. Nope! Ow. Come on, let's see some up. Doo -doo 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 -doo. 
I don't have a flaming sword. This doesn't hurt as well. Bam! Looks like we got them all. Oh yes. And you know what? Let's for shits and giggles, let's go ahead and trade out law with uh Dohalim. So I have two kind of magic users <clears throat> and two physical users. Especially since, you know, I could use some healing from Dohalim since he does have some healing arts. Not as much as Shion, of course, but, you know, his healing hearts will do the trick for now. Ooh, silver chunk. I don't know. Oh, fishing! <clears throat> I'm gonna do, do some fishing real quick. Where, Where are you? Where should I cast my line? Ah, there you are. <laughs> yeah. Yoink! Don't back away from me, you little fish bitch. There we go. There we go. Oh shit. Come on. Yeah. We got it. We got it. It's all under control. Well, that wasn't much of a challenge. That went pretty well. Oh, this is a dead in bass. Boo! Ah, there's a fish. Yoink! Okay, let's try it. I've got something. Come on. We, we got it. There we go. Is this just gonna be Dan and Bass here? I was hoping for something bigger. Well, that wasn't much of a challenge. Nice. Oh god, that you thing is it. tiny. <clears throat> All right, let's try it. Boop, boop. There we go. Yeah. Take your fishy. Take it. Go on. Take your fishy. There we go. So maybe there's not that many fishes well, here. That wasn't much of a challenge. What the? Guess it's important to stay calm. Oh, the different fish. Uh, you know what? Let's change it real quick. I don't know if that will You're change still much. Not done fishing yet? No. Nope. You need patience to fish. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay. Let's see what we got. Oh shit! Oh god, this one's uh really fighting me. There we go. I didn't think I'd catch something this big. You tamed a real beast. Ooh. All right, let's quit fishing for now. <clears throat> there it is. That's our target. Oh, right, the side quest. I forgot I was doing side quest. That's far enough. I can't get out of this. There we go. Got the soldier bomb. Oh, I want to hold the button down for 
uh, flaming sword, but it won't start even holding the button down, it just doesn't do anything. Oh, well that was anticlimactic a little bit. I can feel my power growing. Yes, thirty-two. Man, this place is thick with foliage. I know. It feels like we're going to be swallowed up by all these plants if we stay in here. Indeed. I much prefer the forests in Menencia myself. Not that I don't agree, but maybe now's not the best time for Elder Menencia Prime. Um. Okay, I thought that was like the end of that little section there without opening up the map fully. Oh, I thought it was dropping down. I couldn't even. It's so hard to see. Ooh. Okay, let's see what these guys. You can do it! Come on, Keystar, you use your use your mistakes, please. There we go. Bam! Come on. Bill Holyman, I thought you had like, some heal. Oh, thank you, Bill Holyman. I was going to say, healing abilities, please. Shit, we yeah, we are. Oh, okay, so there is an owl near here. My first instinct is to... Oh. Ah, there you are. Can I... Can I just reach you if I cross over there? I'm gonna try it. Don't fall, don't fall. Yes! <laughs> right bandage. Hmm? You're saying we should check the owl forest? We will once I can actually travel out of here. Come on. I'm not able to use a mystic heart. 
I need the flaming sword to use a mystic oh, card. Oh, that's gonna suck so freaking bad. Whoop, right past you. Whoop, treasure. And, all right, let's beat you all up now. Um, I was gonna say hello. Go no further. Be careful, everyone. This one is the normal. You made me angry. That was a bad idea. Short way to help us. I'll take you all on. Oh, am I gonna take down one of them at least? There we go. Oh, come on. All right. And that fight's over finally. Than before. Well, good for you, because, uh, yeah, you're 32 now. In fact, 32, 32, 31, 32, 32. So, Doe Helene's almost a 32 at least. Ah! Are those? Yep, there they are. There's the Zoogle we were asked to handle. Alright, let's take care of them. Yeah. You picked the wrong Nope. Bam! Is there where the hell the other one go? Everyone still in one piece? Yep. I barely worked up a sweat. Ah, if only I could stop pressing the wrong buttons. Okay, cool. So I can actually really just go back in the town and take that uh, quest off. Which I might just do. There. You don't see me. What's with that shining foe over there? Oh, okay. We're gonna fight you real quick. Clear the way through. I've got your back. Look sharp. Not a chance. No. Uh, I want to use a mystic art. Okay, that was weird that I did that, but we'll work with it. Come on. 
Thank you. Hi, you met. Damn. Bam. My exploits are bearing fruit. That's a lot better. Well, yes, I am going to lose that, uh, that bar here pretty quick, unfortunately, but at least this is done. I guess. I just want to be done with the quest itself. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh yeah, that's good. That means we won't go hungry now either. Yes. I really do love to fish, though. Love to fish, though. Nothing beats going out and casting your trusty rod. Oh, actually, we use nets to fish here. Way easier that way. Really? You what? Mm. They prefer to fish in bulk, whereas you enjoy the thrill on one-on-one -on -one battle. It's simply a difference in philosophy. If you ever need a fishing partner, I, for one, am always happy to accompany Don't you. <laughs> oh, things are heating up over here. Looks like you caught a, caught a real keeper yourself, friend. Anyway... Thanks for all your help with them eight bugles. Now we can fish in peace again. I just want the money. Dovalin, I'm going to look into some seasonal fishing spots. Mm. Come on, come on, come on. By all come means. On. Leave the preparations to me as well. I'll bring the rods. Would you prefer... Oh, I think I just got it just in time. Ow. No! Oh, come on, Rin, please. Please do the thing. Please do the thing. Do your most of Oh, she didn't do her mystic art. Um, uh, use an item this time. There we go. Now oh, that looks like that hurts. BAM! I don't have much left. Sword ring alpha! I feel the power flowing through me. Ooh, I actually made that in time. Yeah. Yeah, I guess I will. No, I, I, I wanted to do that. There we go. Okay, so I gotta go that way. Retreat if you know what's good for you. Excuse me, did he just do that twice, you little orbit? And bam. Alright, at least one more. Oh, 
Ah, that fight's over finally. I like the energy for healing arts. Well, then stop lacking energy for healing arts. How about that? There we go. Not full wait a second. Am I is he level 32 now? Yes, he is. Cool. I was a little worried. Now, the reason why I'm actually just now just fighting all these guys is so that way I can at least hopefully get a couple more levels out of them before I, uh... Before I have to continue too much more with uh, the story and the next potential boss fight. Ow! You little bitch! God damn! Thank you, Dohuin! You're a good buddy! God damn, doing impact cross over and over again on these guys just to beat them. A comfortable win. Now if only I had some food that actually like boosts my uh, EXP up so I can level up faster. Wait a minute. Damn it! There we go. Okay, I've already done all that exploring there, so I don't need to go that way. Ooh. Damn it, I, hope, I don't know if I got it in time. Thank you, Dohuin! Nope! Nope again! Come on! One down! Exactly. And sadly, I did not make it to, uh, to get the extra, uh, boost in my, uh, XP or whatnot. Damn. Oh well. Come here, tomato. Um. At least, uh, Offense almost 33, Ridwell is 33, Dolan Lane 32, Kisara 32, and Maw 33. Alright, let's, let's see what happens. Once we get to the mountain, the terrain won't be easy. We should rest up here before pressing on. But what about Xion? She's waiting for us. All the more reason to conserve our energy. Huh? 
It's not only the mountain. Hard though that may be, it's a pittance compared to what follows. Namely, Volron. We wear ourselves out now, or worse still, get injured. We might as well show up gift-wrapped. Right, Kisara? That's right. Besides, Alfin still hasn't fully recuperated yet. I'm fine. Don't stop on my account. Oh, really? Well, in that case, it's me who wants to take a rest for a while. Does that suit you better? <laughs> a little bit. Okay, fine, we'll take a rest. Okay, so is there a camp up ahead? That's what they're saying. I can never figure out the legends in this map. Yes. Uh, I wanted a, a, a camp! So, Alfin, 300 years, huh? Care to share the secret to such a long and healthy life? I wish I knew. Once I left Lenigus, the next thing I remember is waking up in Calaglia. Everything in between is a blank. You mean, there are still gaps in your memory? I've heard of starships with devices that can stave off imminent death by putting their passenger into a deep sleep. They're usually only intended as a temporary solution, until proper treatment for an ailment or injury can be obtained. You think he might have been asleep in that starship for 300 years? But why? What would be the point? Might this Naori have had a hand in it? What do you mean? If she's Renan like you say she is, she would have understood how to operate the starship better than yourself. <laughs> You're saying she deliberately put me to sleep for 300 years? Dohalim, that's a bit of a leap. Forgive me, I spoke out of turn. I'm merely thinking aloud, that's all. Shion and the Maiden Naori. After 300 years, it's not unreasonable to suspect they may be related. Shion is nearly the perfect image of her, yes? She also just so happens to be connected to you. Is it merely a coincidence? <sighs> like I've told you a million times already, I wouldn't know. Well, if you're absolutely certain that it couldn't have been Naori, then I guess I must have been mistaken. Complicated machinery can sometimes break down or have failures. Sorry for being presumptuous. <sighs> Hold on a sec. Alvin. You said the mask was to placate you, right? To keep your guilt and rage in check? And you were wearing it the whole time you were asleep, right? I guess I must have been. So that's 300 years you were wearing it. It's just a hunch, but do you think that the mask might be... The reason he lost all his memories? All but a select few strong ones. So deeply ingrained in his psyche that he saw them in the form of dreams. It's not completely out of the question. In which case, maybe it was the mask numbing his sense of pain, too. It's certainly possible. As for how, I wouldn't know. But the dampening effect on his psyche could have manifested itself physically as well. <sighs> I'm sorry for snapping at you back there. It's thanks to you that I feel like I'm... No, that we're finally getting somewhere with all this. No apologies necessary. Reading others' feelings has never been my strong suit. So he finally admits it. I really hope Xion's okay. I get why you're concerned. But if you don't rest when you can, you're going to regret it. She's right. We need our rest to conserve our strength. Yeah, you're right. Thanks, you two. No problem. We'll save Xion. I know we will. Yeah, we're going to do the best we can to save Xion. We're going to do some cooking first, just that way, because uh, I noticed that the effect of the cooking was about to wear off anyways. So, uh, melted and combat points. God damn, that's gonna, that's like almost nothing. This is a true masterpiece, no less than culinary art. That's the first time I had Dolhalim cook, and that did not disappoint. Oh, not even talking, shit, okay.
alone. I'm all alone. Let's go. We don't want to keep Xion waiting. Exactly. Winwell's muttering. I always hear you muttering to yourself whenever we're in battle. So, uh, just what are you saying? Why do you want to know? Does it bother you or something? Not really. It's just the way you talk is sometimes kind of creepy. So I was wondering if you vent your frustration through your magic. Are you yelling, you stupid jerk, or something like that to pump yourself up? What? No, that's not what's happening during my incantations. I'm just focused, so I match my tone to fit the mood of whatever I'm trying to invoke. Invoke? Uh, how do I put it? Basically, the elemental astral energy behind each art, I guess. Astral energy? Hold on, are you saying you can talk to astral energy? Uh, not exactly. But if I put emotion into what I say, it's easier for me to properly cast my arts. That makes sense? Kind of. Okay, so if you can talk to astral energy, then you can ask it to, like, predict the weather or find secret treasure? Wait, you don't really think that, do you? Or you can ask it to send out lightning to where there's bad guys lurking and... May lightning condemn those who bear fall. Thunderblade! Ah, what are you doing? You almost fried me with that! I just asked the astral energy to send down lightning where there were annoying boys. <laughs> oh god, I love the chemistry with uh, Rinwell and um and Law. They those two make a do the so well. They do so well together. I love it. I don't know what to do. Things can't go on like this. What do you mean? Ah! Oh. It's you, Rinwell. You were talking about me, weren't you? No, I wasn't. I've just been thinking about some things. Really? How unusual. Cut it out. I'm being serious here. Uh, sorry. I was thinking about... You know how I used to work for Ganabel back when I was in Cislodia? Yeah, of course. You were brought in after the Snake Eyes killed your friends, right? I mean, you had to. Right. I used to have nightmares about it when I fell asleep. But lately, that's been happening a lot less. I don't know how to feel about that. That's a good thing, isn't it? You should be happy. Yeah, but... <sighs> I did a lot of terrible things back then. And I'm scared I'm starting to forget what I did. Okay, so let me just get all of this straight. You think you'll forget everything if you stop having those nightmares? Why? Because, uh, you know me, I'm freaking stupid. But it sure doesn't sound to me like you've forgotten. Oh well, yeah, but still. I don't think those nightmares going away means you've forgotten. Maybe it's a sign that you've come to terms with what you did. Come to terms? You mean like Alfin with his past? You think that's what's happening? Yeah, I do. <sighs> You're pretty amazing, Law. I am? Yeah. Not all of us have figured out how to accept our pasts. Least of all, me. Rinwell. God, again, I love the chemistry with these characters. It's just so perfect. Ooh, oh, that's pretty. Anyways, let's go on ahead and go inside, because what's the worst that can happen other than I get killed off? Ah, what the shit, Biscuit? Caves, I don't want to deal with caves. We're going to climb? The villagers managed it on their escape from the city. We're going in the opposite direction, but... Oh, God. Is it just me, or does Rinwell suddenly seem much more comfortable around Dohalim than she used to? I noticed that, too. When the two of them came and found me together back on the beach, I could hardly believe my eyes. It's not like we had a choice or anything. Law and Kisara had to hang back to convince the villagers we meant them no harm. 
<laughs> More than that, though. There are a lot of things I've still got to come to terms with regarding Almadria. But I guess I'm through making snap judgments based on someone's origin. At least, I'm trying to be. I guess you could say it's a work in progress. I see. You hear that, Law? Sounds like all that hard effort wasn't for nothing. Yeah. That's got to be reassuring to hear. Right, Dohalim? Not being subjected to unwarranted suspicion is certainly welcome. Yeah. That long-winded way you have of talking, though? Not so much a fan of that. I think that's more of a personality thing than a Renin trait. Really? In that case, I won't have to feel guilty getting annoyed by it. <sighs> Necessary when creating weaponry. Crap. This injury hurts more than I thought. Shion, sorry, but could you? Oh. Right. Any enemy with my mace. Awesome! We've got an avatar of destruction here! Truly, she leaves naught but rubble in her wake. Are you guys asking to be her next target? To achieve such harmony? It takes a singular will. Eat 
Victor! Raging Captain! Victor! Victor! I'm ready! Take! Blow them away! None can! Our next for coming through! This one's mine! They smite with black and gray! Hurricane Strike! You're mine! I'm gone! Dragon Swarm! Severing wind! Shattering the pieces! Attack time! Captain Swarm! Is that a healing art? It is. I can't ignore the pain. I'll try to get it. In an instant! Impact block! We work well together. But you're finally time to block. Look sharp! Sword Ray Alpha! Severing wind! Rising focus! You're mine! Seismic rush! I'm gone! Death on the way! Rising focus! Frozen! Hammer! Hold up! Is this as valuable as I think it is? No choice! In a bind! Is it just me, or is anyone else peckish? think about tonight's menu. Seriously? Is this a joke?
We work well together. Like a finely timed war. Leave the enemy arc to me. No complaint here. Lady Fortune must truly be watching over me. I've never stood so close to a waterfall like this before. I bet it'd feel real refreshing to take a shower underneath this water. You're welcome to try, but that water pressure would likely crush you to a pulp. I'll do my best! I can carve through armor! Dragon Swarm! Sword Raid Alpha! Together, there is nothing that can stop us. Indeed, as one, we are unrivaled. And that is our greatest strength. Training is paying off. 